what is up everybody welcome back to real time i'm rob i'm brace and i'm zuff and today we are back with another episode of avatar the last airbender this is book one episode five the king of omashu last episode was the kiyoshi warriors and obviously we got introduced to the kiyoshi warriors they are very very cool they are named after one of the previous avatars avatar kiyoshi but yeah ang wanted to stop on this island to take a little break i guess he just wants to have fun he was talking about riding the koi fish and he got his wish but it seemed like he was letting the uh the popularity get to his head a little bit he was getting a little arrogant and uh katara definitely was disappointed in, in his jealous. behavior a little bit last episode he was a little jealous for sure you can tell there's something going on there they like each other but speaking about liking each other um Sokka, I think he likes that one Kyoshi warrior girl. He she gave him a smooch, and he was real happy. This one's called the King of Omashu. I mean, a lot of these titles have been like new places they're going every time. I know people talk about the world in the show a lot, how great it is, and if every episode's gonna be like introducing a new spot of the world or new people and stuff. I could totally get used to that because I think that's the coolest part so far. Just like seeing this random village last time of Kyoshi and these girl warriors and just like their their traditions and what they got going on and how they've been out of the war. It's just very interesting to me. So if we keep getting episodes like this, I'm so down for it because I'm already loving the world and we I don't really understand the scale of it yet, to be honest. So um, I'm sure I'll learn more as we go. but. I'm excited to meet the king. It sounds like a very powerful man that probably knows some stuff that will help us out on our journey. So let's get into this one. All right, guys. Well, that's pretty much it. Before we do get into the episode, if you have been liking all of the Avatar The Last Airbender reactions, please leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. Check out all the links in our description as well. We got the Patreon, Discord, all of our social medias, our second channel, and our PO box. Make sure to check all those out. And with all that being said, we're going to get right into the episode. Avatar The Last Airbender, book one, episode five, The King of Omashu. Let's do it. Ooh. The Earth Kingdom, city of Amashu. Earth Kingdom, baby. <clears throat> How'd they get here? Ong. Flying bison. Ang. <laughs> Ong. Never heard of him. I did. You need a disguise. So what am I supposed to do? Grow a mustache? <laughs> I love mustache. Oh, it's a good disguise. I might have a mustache. After oh, this. you do have one. Oh, wow. Is that Oppa fur? It might be. <laughs> <laughs> old man Ang. I mean, he literally is an old man. 112 years old. Someone said the old man Ang Fumpo Pop. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> wow, there's so much going on right now. <laughs> Fumpo Pop. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Oh. oh, is this earth bending? Not the cabbages. cabbages. <laughs> earth bending's gotta be cool. Just tell me who you are. Name's Bonzu. Pippin Petal loves the couple. It's the fakest name you've ever heard. Hi, June Pippin Petal loves the Nice to meet you. How'd she remember that? See that your grandfather stays out of trouble. Enjoy your mushroom. We will. Very low. They're not like barriers to entry. They're not like, yo, what's with the water tribe outfits? You're a strong young boy. Show some respect for the elderly and carry your grandfather's bag. Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Can Aang just stay an old man? I like this Aang. Whoa, this looks like the place that Daenerys was at. She's been to a couple places. To the, like the sand place. Oh. Oh, that's, um, Momo. Momo, yeah. Whoa. Miles and miles of that is so cool. Uh, earth brings the up. Oh, earthbending is dope. Brings them down. It's cool. I definitely like earthbending, but requires earth. <laughs> Seems like it's your f least favorite. It just requires earth to be around, whereas, like, air, you just... Oh, there's some air. There's Fire. Oh. There's some fire. There's no air on the sun. You gotta open your brain to the possibility. Who's that? His friend. Boomy? 100 years ago. The world's greatest super slide. 
Oh, 100 years ago? Yeah, it's like, this is the last time Aang was here. He looks like a crazy boy. <laughs> Acts like it, too. Yeah! You think he knows him still? Probably dead. 100 years. Yeah! Baka hasn't said a word yet. Whoa, I'm trying to go on one of the earth slides. Oh, it's... <laughs> Sokka? Oh! Whoa, that was your plan? Went off course. You'll be going off to combat soon. It's important that you be prepared for... <laughs> He's saying it's... <laughs> <laughs> Classic freeze frame. Oh, yeah. Oh, we have an airbender with us. On to the next room. Don't ruin that vase. No, they ruined the vase. <laughs> Not the cabbages again. <laughs> this guy's freaking cabbages. Never mess with a man's cabbages. He's the king, Amusho? Amashu? Oh, it looks like the guy. His friend? Kinda does. I think it's gonna be his friend. Throw them. A feast! <laughs> a feast? Who does he look like? Doofenshmirtz? A feast! Doofenshmirtz even incorporated! He looks like Fred from Courage the Cowardly Dog. Who is Fred? He's one of the, like, uh, monsters. Oh, well now the airbending is revealed. The Avatar! Mmm. Now, what do you have to say for yourself, Mr. Pippin Paddleopsicopolis? <laughs> You've been busted! Your identity is revealed! Doofenshmirtz Family Incorporated! You're so late. You can't keep us here. Let us leave! Let us leave? <laughs> <laughs> Guy is a clown. Get some rest, eh? Looks like you'll need it for tomorrow. But dum a dum bum bum dum. Saga? Katara? Oh. Where are my friends? They are not hearing. First. Why is he making him do challenges? <laughs> it reminds me of the Mario movie. I guess it's fine. I don't know if purple is his color. The royal color. He's the king. Ah, it's already creeping! <laughs> I'll do what you want. Anything to save our friends, Aang. Aang, Katara, and Sokka. This is slight work for Aang. Yeah, are we, are we gonna challenge him at all, or...? Oh! Ugh. Ooh. Ooh. Sh shot him straight down. He needs the water ban. I'm sure it'll work eventually. This guy's an asshole. <laughs> Whoa. That was smart. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was dope. It seems I've lost my pet Flopsy. Oh. oh. What is that thing? It looks like a Star Wars character. Wait a minute. Is that Flopsy's mother? It's just a big version of whatever the little thing is. <laughs> that is Flopsy. Flopsy! <laughs> He's a good guy. Very nice. Not him. <coughs> Left. But it's probably a trick, though. I... <laughs> Is he gonna choose right? You. Oh. He chooses the king. <laughs> wow. <laughs> My dude's jacked. He's an earthbender. King of the earthbending city. I'm the most powerful earthbender you'll ever see. <laughs> 
fight the guy with the axe. <laughs> he regrets his choice. Can't really hang with this guy right now, Ang. Oh, that's crazy. I love when he gets on his air ball. Did someone leave the window? <laughs> it feels a little drafty in here. Are you hoping I'll catch a call? He's actually just trolling the avatar. Just playing with him. Ooh. Oh, we got out. Oh, yeah. You got a hit in, Aang. Nice. This is OP for him. Okay. <laughs> That's a big, big rock. Aang's creating a tornado right now. Literally. Tornado. What's stronger, earth or air? Throw it back at him. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Answer this one question, and I will set your <coughs> friends free. What? Boomy. Is my name. King of Umashu. I got it! Yeah? He's an earthbender, right? Rocky! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Sokka, shut up. I had to open my brain to the possibilities. Boomy. He laughs like him. Yeah, it is him. <laughs> Boomy! <laughs> it's good to see you. You haven't changed. <laughs> well, he hasn't. <laughs> Aang has a friend from the old world still. I figured that was the guy from way back then. It just looks exactly like him. The world has changed in the hundred years you've been gone. It's the duty of the Avatar to restore balance to the world by defeating Fire Lord Ozai. That's Zuko's dad? Yep. The Fire Lord. You'll need your friends to help you defeat <laughs> the friends that were captured in rock candy the whole time. You'll need them. <laughs> I have a challenge for you. Ooh, Momo. A race? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, where's that man's hair? Just like old times. <laughs> no. Not the cabbage. All right, wow, what a fun episode. That was fun meeting up with Boomy again. He was extremely funny. He was a jokester for sure, and he was a good fighter. He prepped um, Aang for a little bit of the future. I feel like we're just a, a bunch of tests. Like last episode, he realized how to be humble. This episode, he's getting some knowledge. He's getting some knowledge from the old Boom, and that's very nice. I'm That episode was fun. The tests were fun, and it was just awesome watching Aang do his stuff like that tornado move was so cool and he did a good job against a, an old man yeah I think that was our first like real introduction to earth bending that I can think of and like I said I thought it looked really cool obviously they were in like a arena that was probably perfect for <laughs> earth bending so that's why Boomy looked so cool when he was fighting but yeah, I thought it was, it was really neat. Boomy, really, really cool. It must be weird seeing your friend, like, because he didn't realize he was gone for a hundred years, and you just wake up and see your friend, and he's this old man. I'm surprised he's still alive, honestly. I don't really know how old people can get here, but um, pretty cool. He ended up becoming the king. He was very smart from a young age, it seemed like, and yeah, just another really cool character to add to this show. But like Zuff said, he definitely did teach him a lot of stuff. I think that he'll use in the future and he did kind of break down like what he's gonna have to do to defeat the the fire lord so now we 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 know what mission we have and he just has to master all these things to be able to take him down yeah i love boomy i think he's such an awesome character and i think it's just so cool for ang to be able to like know somebody still because like i mean i if i was him i would have fully expected that everybody that i knew would be dead and just the fact that he still has a friend alive from when he was 12 is it's crazy and probably just feels so good for Aang. I do have to say uh, we, we got introduced to the cabbage guy this episode. Oh, yeah. And he, he is a, a massive meme in the, the Avatar really? show. Yeah, the, the cabbage guy is a huge, huge meme. And I saw this online. And I need you guys to let me know if it's true or not. 
but apparently the voice actor for the cabbage guy is going to play the cabbage guy in the live what? action version of the show i saw that online i need you guys to let me know if that's true or not because that <laughs> would that would actually be unreal but uh yeah an another good episode excited to keep going all right guys well, that's pretty much it for this episode if you have been liking all of the avatar reactions please leave a like drop a comment and subscribe check out all the links in our description as well we have our patreon discord all of our social medias our second channel and our po box make sure to check all those out and with all that being said we will see you guys next time in avatar the last airbender episode six peace out